Happy Mother's Day. And every Mother's Day, the most favourite cut flower is the chrysanthemum. And the reason why is because the last three letters of the word chrysanthemum spells mum. Now, as you can see here, the gorgeous chrysanthemum is presenting in the beautiful vase here. Now, I just wanted to um, deliberately leave, leave the stained leaf on the stem because as soon as you see or sight aging on your chrysanthemum, you need to remove it. And aging starts from the bottom up. So you would never see a leaf aging from the top down. It's always from the bottom up. So that needs to be removed because that's then releasing the gas ethylene. And we don't want that because ethylene is an odorless gas that you know, uh, decreases the vase life of the chrysanthemum. So that gets removed. Now this is a female because when it's a female cut flower, it means that it comes from a root system off a tree. And with females, we slip on the heels, don't we? And no hairy legs in the vase. Now this is also a cut flower to be enjoyed in the home, preferably on the dining table when everybody's sitting around having, you know, the Sunday lunch, especially if you've, if you've, if you've got a sister that you don't see eye to eye with. This is the perfect flower to engage amongst your food because it is going to settle down sibling rivalry. Now, if you have not so much strong communication in the household or your kids are fighting and you, you're looking for that balance at home, you need to invest in chrysanthemum because it brings harmony, joy, and balance in the household, a must to have on your dining table or on your kitchen bench top every single day to encourage love and harmony. I hope you've enjoyed today's tip.